I'm underneath the sewer like some swamp rat. That's because earlier I was chased by some demonic dog that you would see in a typical Call of Duty game. I'm surprised the game didn't say, fetch me their souls, type of looking demonic dog. Okay, I gotta figure out what to do here. Wait a minute. Huh. Am I... Okay, so, yes, I'm on the outside of the castle here. And I'm just wondering, if I were to, say, use this on this big old cuddly pup, would said pup calm down? Wait a minute. Can I? Oh, this is sick. I could. Hold on. Can I shoot the dog? Come on, doggy. Why are you not dying? This is horrible. Why is this dog not dying? Why is the dog not dying? Why is this demonic dog... Okay, now it's dead. Okay. So it doesn't do well with the... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, I'm screwed. I am so... Right here. Right here. Oh gosh, I'm gonna die. Wow. You- you- you kidding me, right? Oh, you stupid dog! Come on! Come on! Okay. I'm carrying this thing, right? And then I'm gonna... Oh gosh, okay, this is not good. Kill it, please, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna leave it alone. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, please subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And also, hit that notification button so you know when I upload my videos. Amelia, dear, if Brianna hears you and her mood is off, you're going to lose an eye making fun like that. She's only having fun, Francesca. And Brianna's too busy with the chameleon to be bothered. She's got her mind on... <sighs> yes, because otherwise the Abbey will see us all blackened by fire. Now stop with this nonsense. Oh, the gossip. The tea is real. I can feel hmm. my power. I can hear her voice. Ooh. Okay, so how am I supposed to get through here? Thrice. That's the part I always mix up. Tap the whalebone thrice. Thrice. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to do here. Okay. Okay. Oh, someone's there. Do I have to kill these people? I mean, I could if I wanted to, but... Okay, so there is some way, shape, or form... <sighs> Come on... Nothing? Feels better. The fresh air really helps. Ooh, they're right there. They are really right there, huh? How am I supposed to get through this? Maybe I could climb? Oh, she's right there. This is so awkward. All right, I'm gonna sneak. Wow, I'm actually doing it. This is fantastic. Ooh, that person's right there too. Okay, sneak again. Fantastic. I love this. Oh my gosh. 
this is such an easier way compared to the first time I did it where I bum rushed the whole castle and everyone was literally just following me. I like this. This is like a very professional sneaking type of setting for me. Okay, so I'm going to go in here, right? No one's going to listen to me or hear me, so... Can I go in, please? Thank the conservatory. you. conservatory. I wanted to visit this place with Wyman. There you go. I closed the window just so they know I didn't go in through here. Okay, we're doing good so far. Oh, I hear someone coughing. Wait. Is there cash? No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. Okay, I got my coins. Oh, I'm so scared. Okay. Okay. No one's here, right? No, no one's here. I'm doing good so far. Oh, this is fantastic. You know, I could see why sneaking is beneficial because you're not dealing with so much unnecessary chaos. Ooh, this is bad. I remember those things. Can I just... Yep. We're doing good so far. Oh, this is good. The anticipation is... Is anyone here? Okay. This is cute. I'm gonna keep on going here. Steady now. Steady as she goes. I feel like if I'm like really quiet. I don't care what anybody says. I know Mutton and that boy. I'm not looking for any charms, okay? Trust me. I'm not that nosy. Oh, I see someone. All right, so I'm gonna go this way. Those double doors should lead me to there, hopefully. Let me see, let me just peek on in. Hello. It's so dark and gloomy. I don't see anyone in here though, so that's a good sign. And even with the loud door closing, people are still not, um, hearing me. But the thing is, I feel like maybe if I go through here on top... Oh my goodness, did I do that? So this is it, the Orca Con. It's got a Okay, so I see two no three individuals here. When are they gonna leave though? I don't mind killing them, but still. I feel like maybe if I eliminate them one by one, it'll be a lot easier for me to just deal with the machine alone. Am I right? Oh, no, that's not what she said, Miss Delilah. It's very specific. Very specific. Then again, there's two up here. Oh, shoot. No, you didn't see me. Okay, here's the thing. I feel like maybe if I like go down and then start, I might as well just, wait a minute, the office. 
Holy cow, yeah, I should go to the office, but then again, I see this dog there. Oh my goodness. What should I do? The whistling. So there's one right there. I have nothing to distract. Uh, this is so much... I need more. I'm just gonna take a chance. Or... What do I have to do here? I'm just curious. There's one right there. She's moving over here. But where is she going? Are you okay? It was a little scratchy. Maybe some steep orange and chamomile will do the trick. The thing is, what if I decide to go down there? Would I be caught? Why are you making so much noise? You know what? Here goes nothing, am I right? I feel like I could do this pretty quietly. So... Wish me luck. Jindosh was tiresome. How does this even work? Alright, cool. I installed, so let me leave. do anything while while they're here so I have to kill them huh I don't mind killing all of them I just don't have the proper tools to do so you know I don't have any bullets they are just jealous if I want to dance, then I can twirl around all I want. Just you go, girl. Stop me. That's right. No one should stop you from dancing. You could dance the night away. Please. How much health do I have? Ten? Mm. I mean, then, then again, if I attack one, I gotta deal with one, two, and three. Plus any possible doggies, too. You know what? Let me go over here, right? And then let me go right up here. Uh, I'm scared because of the dog, though. Did Jindosh die? Someone got inside that strange house of his. I don't know, Dad. Have you? No, my dear. It's a loss. But I doubt he had anything more to give us. Sokolov was taken away as well. Who would want that ancient fool? Excuse me? Mind. How goes the communion? I am hungry to whisper into the ears of the oracular sisters. My influence grows. Last night, I walked through... You didn't see me. You didn't see me. I see your burn suspicions were right. Oh, these dogs. They know I'm here. They know. Oh shit! Sorry. Oh great. This is gonna be. Yep. All right. Let's um go ahead and deal with the awkwardness. Come on. Come on. There you go. Oh yeah. This is gonna be a pain in the butt. Let's go. Ooh, what the heck? What the heck is this? What are you trying to do? Bye. Okay. Excuse me. There you go, doggy. You're done too. Delilah? 
Excuse me. Come here. Oh, wait. I'm gonna be battling with these dogs for the rest of my life at this point, huh? Come on. Come on. All right. Now all I gotta do is work on what? These damn dogs. Ha ha! You can't get me, Pejito! Anyways, hold on. Let me catch a breath, because she's dead. And that's a good thing. She's dead. Oh, this stupid dog. Hold on. No. Maybe? Hi! They definitely heard that, and now's my chance to see what's up, right? Okay, so Delilah, when we can't talk, I write. There are things only you will understand. Daily, I feel my connection to the void growing. And through me, your power calls out to those who would join our coven. New faces, new voices. Our bond is stronger than it was at Bridgemore. Yet you feel so far away. If we were together, I would say more. It is as if I can see beyond the air into another time or place. You have parted a curtain I never knew was there. Oh, Delilah, strange and beautiful whispers are carried on the breeze. I am forever grateful of being your Listen here, little jerk. Come here. Oh, gosh. All right, so there has to be some sort of a window. Yes, thank you. I'm going to grab carry. And I'm going to throw. Oh, come on. Come on, doggy. Get, get. Anyways. Oh, my gosh. Another one. Another one. Hold on. Thank you. Come on. This is ridiculous. Carry, and then I'm gonna throw out the window. Come here. Where you at? Where you at? Thank you. I'm gonna carry you, and I'm also gonna throw you out the window. Ha ha! Ha ha! Oh, thank goodness. Looky, looky, she's dead. She is dead. I'll take that. And, uh,. Talk, There's Delilah. no turning back for you, Delilah. You've given me no choice. Oh, little Emily. So very far from home. You're going to pay for all the people you've butchered. And for everything you've stolen from me. It should have been mine to begin with. As if, everything lady. that's happened is wrong. But don't you worry. I'm going to make it all better. Give me back my throne and my father. Come and take them, girl. I welcome you to my tower. You know what? Mm, oh, I can't even do anything. Uh, anyways. What else can I look through in this office? Any goodies? No? Nothing. Mistress Brianna, like you asked, I stored your autograph recordings in the archive down there in the basement. And I tidied up around the Orca column, just as you asked. Some of the others were talking about the old lenses you took out of that Orca column device after the incident. Saying they were going to bury them lenses forever at the bottom of the ocean. Well, that didn't sound right to me, so I just stored them in the effigies workshop in case you find them some use. All my other chores are done, so I'll go prepare your leche drizzle tea. I'm grateful for the second chance you've given me. I'm sure over time I'll feel Delilah's presence and learn magic. Like my coven sisters, please don't cast me out. I'll make you and Empress Delilah proud, I promise. Karina. Ashworth's journal might tell me more about why Delilah can't be killed. I got some bullets, so this is good. Um, what else? 
how am I supposed to get to... Uh, okay, I gotta... I gotta figure something out here. Oh, this is cute. So this is her whole office, huh? Oh, no, no. That's not her whole office, per se, but... Typewriter. But there's really nothing for me to take, huh? I'm not gonna set an alarm clock. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. You ready? At this point, I got some bullets. Three, specifically. Horrible. A ruin right over there. Ruin right over there. A bone charm. Wait a minute, dude, I almost forgot. I can always go upstairs, duh. Let me see if I'm able to get something here. I totally forgot she had the second floor. Oh, wow. What's in here? Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go in. For sure. Wow, so many plants. Huh. Thank you. I got another bone charm, you guys. Isn't that cool? I set out to craft a new bone charm, and I hope it to have it black in. In keeping with those greater power, it will complement the one I've carried since finding it within a uh, completement. The one I've carried since finding it within a Molosseum in Alba. Though it's rare to meet others touched by the void. Summoners beware, for as long as I carry that bone charm, their rats and vermin will turn against them. And the new charm, if it works, will shield me against assassins. I am still working on my protective charm. I have taken the Tyvan gray bone recipe and altered it, using much more burdock root. The instructions were vague, and the safeguards it offers are weak. Neither camel Mao nor Nastratums added to the mix give me the right effect. Though they perfume the air quite nicely, I feel well protected from unpleasant smells, but not much else. I finally got it. Hellebore, of course, fermented and reduced over a low flame. It's rare to achieve this effect where the bone charm turns darkest black. As I wanted it, I'm warned against the first bullet or bolt from an assassin's weapon. The initial shot that would fell me will instead change to blood flies in an instant. Okay. Thank you for the heads up. Sounds like someone is really weak. Ah, oh, really? And this is a really nice bathtub. You gonna use that for flowers? Oh, okay. I remember. I remember this place. Yep, and that's below. That's them. The Grand Palace released a brief statement today regarding the recent demise of our irreplaceable Curran Jindosh, the famed Grand Inventor for the nation of Sir Konos. The statement indicated that all evidence gathered thus far points decidedly to the Crown Killer. He remains on the loose and is actively being sought by the Grand Sir Conan guard at this time. The statement went on to say that the Empire has lost its most brilliant mind and that the now vacant position of Grand Inventor would not be easily be filled. Jindosh is best known for inventing the astonishing clockwork soldiers as well as the silver graph machine. He is definitely not going to be missed, but whatever. Whatever. He was a pain in the ass to deal with. And get rid of. I'm not gonna lie. <gasps> Thank you. Oh, dude, I could do the sleep darts. Duh. Oh, I'm getting mad money for this. Okay. I don't know what type of handwriting is this, but I'm glad I'm not able to read it. What's this? Wait, hold on. The Oracle Sisters. It's been difficult to create effigies of the... Wait a minute, I've read this one before. I read it on the last episode. I'm not going to read it again. 
Huh. I'm not interested in reading those two, but... These odd lenses might be linked to what Ashworth is working on. And these are the original lessons. lenses. Sorry. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I meant nothing to my fine family. Beyond an advantageous marriage and years of childbearing. They promised me to a man three times my age who wheezed on about our wedding night. But a curious thing happened on the way to the altar, Delilah. From the first time I slipped out of the manor in the dead of night, there was no returning to my cage. Looking at the stars and drinking wine on a rooftop, I was free. Instead of seeing the overseers for marriage, I visited my father's banker and raced away from my old life. Delilah. Those were the coven's glory days. Alright, I have the plan. Check this out. Oh, this is outside. No, I'm not going outside, but I do have a plan, though. I have about three sleep darts, right? I'm gonna put all of those little demonic sisters to sleep. That's my best bet at this point. I mean, how else am I supposed to do this? Am I right? You tell me if there's like another alternative. Come on, is there a way for me to... Come on, are you serious? Fine, fine, fine. I guess I'll go downstairs in the, in the first floor. Like a good citizen of the law, I guess. Come on, let me get in, please. Can I get in? Thank you. Alright, so let me go ahead, go downstairs, right? What's in here? Oh, this is outside. Okay, never mind, I'm not going outside. Her Majesty Delilah Caldwin? She ain't no Majesty, I don't recognize her. Okay, so... Yep, second floor it is. You ready? I know I am. Okay. Hope this works, because if not, it's going to be pretty awkward. <sighs> Alright, let me see. Oh, demons do go to sleep. How cute. I'm excited! Alright, the second one right here. Are you ready? Come on, go to bed. Go to bed. Night night. Oh, this is beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, are we good? Yeah, we're good. So, can we use this or not? Like, what's, uh... Who saw me? Oh, snap. What? Hi! Uh, go to bed. Shh, go to bed. Shh, go to bed. Good. Good. Anyways. As I was... Oh no, this is bad! Stop mine! Stop mine? Oh gosh, okay. I guess I can kill them. Oh gosh, this is bad. This is bad. Right here. Woo! Oh, uh, right here. Right here. Okay, okay. Um, are we good? Did they escape? Oh, uh, this is so bull! Alright. Right here. Right here. Come on. Alright, we should be good, right? What is this? What is this? Who are, who are these people? 
Oh, uh, this is some voodoo stuff. I can tell. Oh, I can tell. I don't know. I just... I don't know. This is, this is some freaky stuff, you guys. I just... I don't know what to do at this point. I really don't. What's this? All of you, if you share my loyalty to Delilah and to her coven, heed my words. Again, I was haunted by nightmares about the Orkulum. The original lenses Jin Dosh used in the device nearly ruined me. I felt Delilah's magic flicker, and the flame she rekindled in me almost went dark, like it did after Bridgemore 15 years ago. I fear another accident like that would cost me everything. My connection to the void, to magic itself. We cannot afford any more mistakes. I will study the discard lenses in my workshop, then have them destroyed. Remember that Delilah is relying on my efforts and the Orkham is attuned to me alone. Do not interfere with the device, only I have a chance to control the Oracle sisters. Oh no, did I did a boo-boo? Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.